Hey everyone, I am Carrie Little. I happen to be the designated managing broker of Caremark Realty Group here in Illinois, and I am actually the blogger of smartgirlmedia.com and the host of Coffee with Carrie every Friday morning, 9 a.m. on Instagram, at least most of the time, assuming I'm not teaching, but typically every Friday, and that is central time. So today I want to talk to you about quick ways to find pre-foreclosures using a tool called Remind. Now, if you happen to be a consumer in your life, oh my gosh, I need access. There are two things you could do. Number one, you don't get access unless you are a licensed realtor member. So you could go get your real estate license, sign up like the rest of us. Or number two, work with a licensed real, real estate professional so they can help you find these deals. Okay, and note, we can't give you access because it is a violation of our rules. Now, don't forget, hit subscribe so you never miss a video every Wednesday. And these are usually short, less than 10-minute videos. I'm still working on a name. So here we go. So I'm logged in. And yes, I can actually shop nationwide. But we're going to keep it simple. We're going to stay here in Northern Illinois. And let's just say I just want to see what's happening in the marketplace. So I'm going to jump over here to the left. And I have a filter that allows me to look for list pendants, notice of default, notice of foreclosure sale, and notice of trustee sale. All right. So what is a list pendants? This is when the attorney that represents the bank is sending their clerk or someone at their office over to the courthouse to start the foreclosure process in Illinois on someone that's not paying their mortgage. Now, you know, there's more steps. A notice of default is typically the first letter that someone gets because they're not paying their mortgage. So they haven't officially started the list pendants process. Notice of foreclosure sale means that the bank has, it's a, it's a notice that you you have been foreclosed on. Now, notice of trustee sale, and you know what? I like to Google things and look things up because I'm not an expert and nor am I an attorney. And here we go. In real estate, a trustee sale means the sale of a real the sale of real property through public auction, a trustee sale usually occurs when the homeowner is in default on their mortgage, resulting in a foreclosure. In this case, after the auction is over, ownership of the property will be transferred to the highest bidder. If you're ever in doubt, great website, Google. Google it. So I'm just going to look for properties that are already, you know, where the list pendants has been filed. And I'm just going to pick a random city you know, as a real estate agent, you're going to work in the neighborhoods you want to work in. So just random. Let's see what we got. So I do like to look at off market properties because it is a violation for me to target active listings. So we're going to go off market and, you know, just for the sake of training, um, I'm just going to put in Romeo Bill. Oh, I got I guess I need to type in more than that. There we go. So this is Romeo Bill. And then the next thing I'll do is come over to Distress Deals and let's see what happens when we click List Pendants Apply. So we had over 10,000 results. There's, only, there's five. So we know that we have five properties where a List Pendants has been filed. Kind of cool for real estate agents, sad for the homeowner. But if you are someone that is in pre-foreclosure, talk to a licensed real estate professional because we can help you through the process because you have options. Now, if I were to go back and add notice of default, let's see if we get any more. Nothing new. Yeah, I typically don't see those. And then notice of foreclosure sale. Let's see, did we go up? Any in inventory with the bank? Nope. And let's try notice of trustee sale. Any auctions? Oh, 15. Interesting. Right. A true afternoon coffee with carry. So I'm going to tell you as a real estate agent, I probably only target the five. So let's clear this and let's look at, I'm going to zoom out and kind of look at the entire marketplace. But remember, I only want to look at off market. So here we'll zoom out and I'm going to try to look at, you know, a lot of Northern Illinois and let's go back to my list pendants. Apply. Wow, in my map view. So let's move this over. Let's get out of Indiana a little bit. There are in my map view 1,487. Kind of interesting. So there's more. Look, there's a lot in this little pocket. When you get a little bit west, 
not as many. When you get north, maybe not as many. But if I were to click on this 1,000, this gives me an idea that there are some areas where we are starting to see more pre foreclosures. So if you're a licensed real estate agent and you haven't signed up to take this class, if you happen to have Remind in your marketplace, it's really a cool tool. So if you do want to learn more from me, sign up in the feed. You can sign up to receive my weekly e-blast. You can also sign up for the agent journey and subscribe to YouTube to make sure you never, ever miss a Wednesday video. So I am Carrie Little, again, the host of Coffee with Carrie every Friday morning at 9 a.m. where I go live to teach you something. And you can always go back and watch the replay. And don't forget to subscribe to YouTube. Check out my blog, smartgirlmedia.com.